Uh, Senator Faruqi. Thank you, President. President, I seek leave to table the names of 6,747 people who have been massacred by the State of Israel in the last five weeks. These are the only names available that we have at the moment. Is leave granted? Leave is not granted, Senator Faruqi. What I am trying to do today is get this chamber to acknowledge the thousands, the thousands of Palestinians that have been massacred brutally over the last 35 days by the State of Israel. These are the names that you don't want to talk about here. These are the names that you don't want to acknowledge because for many, these people are not considered humans. But these are humans. These are children, a few months old children, babies, one year old, two years old, three year old, four year old, five year old, six year old, seven year old, eight year old, nine year old, ten year old. And the list just keeps growing. These are hopes and dreams. These are lives completely snatched away from their loved ones. I met with someone yesterday, 42 members of whose family have been murdered in Gaza. And yet, and yet the Labour government does not have the heart to call for a ceasefire. The Labour government is seeing a child being killed every 10 minutes, but won't call for a ceasefire. Happy to talk weasel words, but weasel words are not going to stop war crimes. You can't even bring yourselves to condemn Israel for the almost 11,000 killings that they have done. I mean, how, how much cowardice are we going to see from this government? I mean, truly, have a heart, have a head. You know, get some guts and stop this massacre. Wake up, Labour. Wake up and call for a ceasefire now.